Hey guys! Welcome to the summer movie in the kitchen. Today we're gonna to be cooking a snack item from the Sonic Cookbook. Now the item we're gonna cook is Eat Red Spears, which is the Tails special snack item. We're each gonna have our special own job in the kitchen. Mine is the mixer slash transfer the ingredients from the bowl to the oven. And mine's just measuring. And I'm gonna be an oven runner. Let's, Let's get, get cooking! Okay, before we get started the cooking, first things first, you'll have to wash our hands. Yep, alrighty. So let's get started. Let's clean these dirty hands. Woo! If you guys haven't seen um, our first summer movie in the kitchen video, go check that out. We made a breakfast item, which was very awesome, so check that out. Anyways, now let's show all the ingredients needed for Eat Red Spears. Uh, next thing is, is the, the ingredients. So we have one 30 ounce can of chickpeas rinsed and dried. We're only using 15, so everything will be in half for us. Yes. So uh, half a tea tablespoon of olive oil, one teaspoon of kosher salt, one teaspoon of cashmere chili powder, what is this regular chili powder today? And three quarters of a teaspoon of turmeric, and then half a teaspoon of paprika, and then a half a teaspoon of cumin and then a half a teaspoon of garlic powder. All right, so those are all of our ingredients. So we're gonna go ahead and get started right away yes. um, in our steps. So Cam is gonna go ahead and start with uh, his oven thing. So Cam, you can go ahead and put your oven to 425, um, which you just click on that screen there. And then click cooking methods. Click on bake and then slide it to 425 and then hit start. There you go. Mm -hmm. And then you can work on spraying that pan and then peep out. Yeah. You can go ahead and start measuring these things. So I can get yes. this pan in right away. I'm going to start measuring all the oil. Okay. Okay. There you go. Wait, pan, chicken peas, rinse. Peep out. You can go ahead and start measuring these things. So I can get yes. this pan in right away if you want to start measuring all the oil. Okay. Wait, can chicken peas rinsed and dried? Okay, so I need to actually dump them out. Let me get my strainer. Okay, cooking is ready to go. Awesome. Our chicken peas, which is like a vegetable. I'm gonna take the pork option instead of the sprinkle option. I'm rinsing them out, the chicken peas. Do it over in the bowl so I don't yeah, spill any. I'm rinsing them. And then I want to dry them. So I'm just going to shake them up a little bit. This is going to be a smaller snack size because usually it's 30 ounce, so it's just half the chicken peas that we have. Which is fine. Make it work, and then I'm gonna pour it into this bowl already. Chicken peas. 
Which is like a vegetable. I'm gonna take the pour option instead of the sprinkle option. I'm and rinsing them out, uh, the chicken peas. I'm rinsing them. And then I want to dry them. So I'm just going to shake them up a little bit. This is going to be a smaller snack size because usually it's 30 ounce, so it's just half the chicken peas that we have, which is fine. Let me get work, and then I'm going to pour it into this bowl already. I'm going to take the cap off. Okay, there we go. Scoop it out. I'm going to take the cap off. I'm there we go. Scoop it out. Can we move that back by the oven? Yet. Add some leftovers. Okay. Make sure you put this back on. And then a half a teaspoon of this. And I take the cover off and just reach in. Put the cover back on. Uh, we're almost there with all of our different seasonings. Nice. There's lots of smells going on. Lots of smells, y'all. There's no pour on this one, so you gotta take the cap off. And then just get that level. Alright, that's all of our things. So we're gonna all the ingredients are in. Toast until well coated. Toss until well. You gotta toss until coated. Toss, 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 toss. Look at him go. We let you slide over here, toss guy. It's look pretty good. Smell the spices. Smells. Little spices. Oh, that might be good. This is our little snack item, so if you want to eat a nice little healthy snack, because these are like a vegetable snack, then here you go. This is a good recipe to make for our lovely friend Tails. Uh, Cam, do you want to read what Tails says on here? I spent a lot of time either in the lab or in a garage, and I don't want to get food all over my projects. <laughs> That's why I make a big bowl of these to snack on. They're tasty and energizing, and the wet and dry back takes care of them. If one of my tails knocks over the bowl, not that, it's a common problem. <clears throat> there we go. Awesome. And then every 10 minutes These he has to well shake. Once he puts it in the oven, he's got to shake it every 10 minutes. So yep, but we're actually going to do it every five minutes since we're doing half the thing. We're only going to do it. 5, 10, 15 minutes. That's true. We're going to bake it for 15 minutes. Every 5 minutes we'll toss it. We did. So now I need to transfer these to the baking thing. Baking sheet. This is going to be interesting. It's going to be a lot. It's a lot of fun doing these. Uh, we're trying some different foods. This is our food, food for the day. A little different. snack. There we go. It's like little, uh... All right, Cam, you want to put that in the oven? Oven mitts are in that drawer. And then we'll set it in for five minutes once you get it in. Once you get it in there. You can just put it in the middle rack. It should be fine. Alexa, set a timer for five minutes. Five minutes, 39. Alexa, stop the timer. Shake the pan. Move it. Yeah, there you go. Move it some more so they all kind of get moving. Stuck 
Should I get a fork? Yeah, maybe open a little bit. Oh, nice. And they can go right back in. <laughs> Alexa, set a timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes, starting now. There we go. We'll be back in 10 minutes. All right, we're gonna shake them up again. Ooh, they look like they got smaller. <laughs> they will get a little smaller. It looks like they're all moving up. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Alright. Awesome, you can put them on in. Back in there, and then we'll probably just do timer for eight minutes. And they should be good. So that was our second time tossing them, so last time, and then they're ready to eat. So Alexa, set a timer for eight minutes. Alexa, set a timer for eight minutes. Eight minutes, starting now. All right, guys, we'll be right back, and then we will go ahead and eat the red spears. I am... Alexa, oh. stop the timer. Crispy. Okay, what do you want? Do it over the counter. Over the counter? Yep. Kind of get them together. So just kind of have it at an angle and then I'll put them into a corner. Is it better to do a carrot cam? Oh, they're definitely hard. <laughs> yeah, they're supposed to. Yeah. They're a snack, the right? The inside is a little soft. I had these before once. Oh, you did? Yeah, they're pretty good. Well, then you'll... F I got a good spice. Then you'll know how we uh, did in our cooking then. Right? Because I made these by myself before, yeah. Yeah. But it's nice to always have a team. Did those turn out? Yeah, they look pretty much just like this. Okay. All right. Put that on top. Yep, yeah, make sure to turn off the oven. Then we'll go ahead put in the middle, and then we'll go ahead and start snacking. Man. Guys, we are back. We're going to be trying these things out. These just came out, so we maybe let them cool down a little bit. But you can smell them. You can smell that seasoning. Got our drink. Mm. Oh, you definitely can smell our it. spice. We put a lot of different spices on there, guys. A whole bunch. Yeah. Should I grab one see if it's hot? Yeah, I think we might let them cool down a little bit. Let's let them cool down for a couple of minutes and then we'll come back and we will do our taste test so they're not burning our mouth. Right. All right, guys, we are back after a couple minutes and we let the uh, Eat Red Spears cool down a little bit. So we'll go ahead and get one to grab one. We're just gonna do our taste test, so go ahead and grab one. Obviously we'll eat more, but I was gonna be our first one. Cheers, guys. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers! Here we go. It's like a softer inside. Yeah. The chickpeas. Definitely can tell it's a pea. Mm -hmm. I think they're. It's pretty good though. The good. spice really adds to it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try a couple more. I'm gonna try a couple more. And it tastes like the ones I made before. Do they? Yeah, yeah. when I made these ones. Oh! <laughs> Eba. I dropped my spear. They're not bad. These, this is a healthy snack too because we're eating a vegetable, chicken peas. Vegetable. Mm -hmm. And the seasoning and stuff. Good Come spice to it. Red spears. Snack. Your hands get a little dirty though. There's a little bit of seasoning on my hand. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Mm -hmm. Let me get a couple more. Man. So make Definitely make you thirsty after a while. Yeah. And it does leave a little bit of that. Yeah, a little bit of 
powder. Powder on your fingers. Yeah, I got it on my shirt, I think. <laughs> um, I'm gonna give it a 6 out of 10. They're done. Flavor's there. Um, it's a pretty decent snack. I feel like it's a, it's a healthy snack item. and It's just not bad. I just, I'm not a crazy big fan of it, but overall pretty good, so 6 out of 10 for me. Yeah, I gave like uh, 7.5. Oh, here we go. Because, like, I don't know, it's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. It's good texture. Oh, okay. Good idea. You yeah. like popping your mouth. Yep. Um, I would do like a 7.5, but I did a little bit lower. Probably about a seven just because I mean they are good but they leave <laughs> all this on your fingers yeah. so I didn't really like that unless you want to like lick your fingers all the time. But that's the only thing I brought it down. Otherwise it's a good show. Yeah. Yep. I love it. Alright, well, thank you guys for watching this episode of Summer Movie in the Kitchen. Um this is really fun making a little snack item from the Sonic Cookbook and so far the recipes that we've been making out of the Sonic Cookbook have been very good. So yes, they are. Yeah. Anyways, thanks guys for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the like button. It helps out the summer movie crew a whole bunch. And we really appreciate your guys' support. And yeah. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you guys in the next summer movie video. Goodbye from Ringo. Hi Dusty. Bye from Lucky, not Sucky. <laughs> we'll see you guys. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. Woo! Oh, yeah. Give me some of these. Mm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Woo!